Man, oh man, I wonder why. You know, so I just finished watching a video from um, General Tito, who was talking about the whole situation with the black woman twerking in um, Washington, D.C., and where twerking coming from. You know, is it hip hop culture? Is it from Africa? I personally don't care. I just, that made me actually look it up in the YouTube engine. And I am just astounded by how much uncensored booty I've seen from black women on these on YouTube. Uncensored, exploited, out there for the world to see. Because it pushes a narrative of this is what black women are good for. And on top of that, he brings up another point. It's about fetish. Okay, so while they are busy looking for Zaddy, this is what Zaddy knows that they're good for. This is what Zaddy wants from them. And this is not for me saying, hey, I want to ruin your IR relationship. I don't want you. Do what you want. I'm just saying, when you get the treatment that you get don't be surprised don't think it's just indigenous to how black men treat black women okay it's not indigenous to that this is how you're depicted on social media a young teenage white boy could put twerking into the youtube search engine and this is what he finds you know he won't find Le Lexi Pantera. Lexi Pantera was teaching white girls how to twerk. I don't know if you know who she is. I don't know if she still twerks anymore. The woman just has, like, she's has an athletic build, but her booty is loose as this nurse at my hospital I work at who always wears thongs under her nursing scrubs so when she walks her booty just swings and all the black girls notice that this little white girl with the loose booty is just all over the place because you see this is what black women care about you see how they can pay attention to this little, little becky with the glasses and the nursing scrubs because they're always competing with booty this is why you notice the angry black women Built like Leslie Jones and Lonnie Love and shit. You know this. A lot of them are angry at black men because this is how they think all black men look at them. Oh, this is the way they want to be looked at and desired. Correct me if I'm wrong. So, to see all of this unedited booty on YouTube. Meanwhile, they flag it down. Black men speaking up against uh, how black women treat them. Black women are against that, but they, they are totally fine with being depicted as booty clappers on YouTube. They, they're totally happy with that because otherwise they will be talking about this. And I don't see a wealth of light-skinned girls in there clapping their booty. I see chocolate sisters. And boy, I love chocolate. But still, I like to unwrap chocolate. I don't like my chocolate exposed all over the place. If you get what I'm saying. You can... Anyway. Anyway. It's just... It's amazing. Priorities are all fucked up. Like Kendrick Lamar said, put energy in wrong shit. And this goes back to a vi another video I just saw earlier today. From Mediocre Tutorials. That he put out, reacted to this black woman talking about why black women are so combative and so angry. A black man can't tell you to um to shape up. He can't tell you nothing. He can't tell you 
even if he respectfully tell you he prefers natural hair women and he wish you would take pride in your hair, he's not demanding you. Some guys can say, like, you know what? I like when girls do that. It's like, oh, it's not your place. Mind your fucking business. And I'm like, okay, okay. I get what you're saying. Mind my business, okay. She's off the list. Or she just made the list. It's like the list of Jericho. He puts on how he used to put on the list everybody that he had a grievance with. You just made the list. That's exactly how you got to do it. So you know you can look at that list and be like, okay, won't visit this again. Not with this person. But yeah, it's like, it's ridiculous. And you know it's a problem. When you have issues with non-white women, I mean non-black women, like white women, Hispanic women, twerking and doing hip-hop dances, yeah, are there to criticize their body because it's all about booty with y'all. But a lot of y'all going under the goddamn knife now. A lot of you are going under the knife at high rates because you have squandered away your natural gifts. Yeah, you eat poorly, y'all don't exercise, y'all don't take care of yourselves properly. But y'all still want the body to do all that booty clapping. You end up clapping two cement bricks together because you done went and got a botched surgery or an illegal surgery where they're not using hospital or medical grade implantations in liquids. They use a cork. <laughs> Look at Miss Miami, that yuck mouth female from Florida. Look at that. Look at her. They tell her she gonna die. She don't give a damn. She don't want to give up the booty. It's all mental. This is how that fetish from Zaddy from years ago with Sarah Bartman. That fetish has been stuck in black women. It's been ingrained into black women for years. Okay? It has. Oh, my God. It's just... It's crazy how much is on there. YouTube, I, I just looked it up because of the General Tito video. And I just was like, look at it, like, why none of this is censored? <sighs> but, like I said, it's all about pushing the agenda. But I digress, y'all. So anyway, y'all, because I'm a fury, I'm here. And now I'm out. Peace. <laughs>